Hello, good morning guys. Um, I don't know where you guys are watching the video from. So I just confirm if my streaming app is working because I don't have my dual monitor. I traveled somewhere else for a bit. That's why I haven't dropped um any tutorial for the new problem it seems to offer after the new update. So I've been having a lot of my viewers say they're having this dump error. Is it dump error also? Yeah, that's what they've been having. I've been telling them to DM me on Instagram and I've been helping a lot of people fix their FIFA 23 there. And most of you guys seem to have this, these issues. And also people with controller issues, people who's, who their controller doesn't work. So I don't know, I might be able to cover both of the error in this video uh first thing you need to do is first off you need to open your steam make sure your steam is running open your um ea app so if your ea app is not logged in for people who is having this option not to play the game from here so you you can do this actually let me sign out sign out here So if you want to sign in, like if you have the game on Steam and you want to sign in on it, make sure you connect your EA app to your Steam account or you log in with your Steam account. So this is what you have to do. Use this Steam here, this Steam option here to log in. Choose the Steam option. It directs you to your browser. You just have to log in here. Like it says, it, it shows you your Steam account, then sign in. So all you have to do is click sign in and allow. And when it's done, it asks you to go back to the EA app. So all you have to do is close this and the EA app should be running. And you should have the game here asking you to launch. It should show this play button, not for people saying it's not available on or they don't have the game purchased on Steam. So what you have to do is well, minimize this. Open your Steam, open your Steam, then go to library, you know, don't do this first. So first thing first, like this is, this is mostly what you need to like, should I say, this is actually the head of this fix. So all you have to do is type in Windows Defender. You should say Windows Security. If you type in Windows Defender, you should say Windows Security. Or you have to type Windows Security fully. So you have to do is launch this. Launch this. Go to Virus and Threat Protection. That's, it should show up here. You can go through this place, this first option here. Or you can come down to Accounts, um, to Virus and Threat Protection here. And it takes you to the same place. So you have to do is go to manage settings here, this place, go to manage settings. And I do turn mine off, as you can see, everything here is off. I do turn mine off because it's kind of useless. I don't browse on um, unofficial sites or something like that. I do that with my phone or something else. Uh, I, I do that with VPN stuff. So I won't advise anybody to browse on unofficial sites or get my official details out of there. But well, what you have to do is turn this off. When, when you are done with this, now scroll down, scroll down to the last, you should see something that says exclusions. So all you have to do is add the FIFA 23 folder as, as an exclusion. So the, the Windows Defender won't read the folder, it won't try to protect anything or stop anything from launching from there. So all you have to do is add or remove exclusions, the last option here. So click that yes then you find you find your fifa i don't know how much let me try to remove this i'll add it again so you guys should see so add an exclusion folder of course folder of course then you have to find it so yours might be opened up or somewhere else just click your main drive or with the drive where you have the game installed so click on the windows program file 86 steam um 
find steam apps common and here's your fifa these are your fifa is so all you have to do is highlight this by clicking by let's click in once and select folder it adds the folder as an exclusion on your windows defender so when you are done with that you just have to close this if you have this turned on please turn it off turn it off you have to close this then go to your steam your steam app library um right click manage you go to uh properties sorry not manage you go to properties then go to local files try to verify integrity of game files and when you are done with that just click browse here so it takes you to the to the FIFA 23 folder to the installation folder of the FIFA 23 so you have to repeat the same process which we do almost every time so the you launch this as administrator easy attitude launcher no, oh this is for my apex sorry sorry this is for my apex you have to click on your FIFA 23 um same thing properties um local files browse when you are done verifying this then you go to local files browse i got fifa 23 folder so it takes you to your 23 folder okay after this right click on this run as administrator opens up this is the e attitude dot game service launcher launcher as administrator it says please start again from original e application you close this that's how it's supposed to be don't panic then you open your installer you open the first folder here the installer folder open this go to e anti cheat launch this as administrator also this is simply uninstalling and reinstalling anti cheat so you have to do is highlight your fifa when the anti cheat opens so first you have to click update they search for updates for any new update actually because uh, i don't know our business with anti chip but i don't know why they gave it to us most of us we don't even use it. we don't we don't cheat on fifa actually people who still want to cheat have success doing it so once it's done it boots back up and you do the same thing click click on this highlight here click on fifa 23 and click uninstall when it's done on install it says uninstall success and click install again and it's done it says install success so all you have to do is close this and go back to the main installation folder and when you are here also when, when you are here all you have to do is launch this for people having let me just for people having the dump error that's all for you all you have to do is launch this um let's click this twice and the game should launch i'll launch it though but for people having issues with their controller or anything you can text me on instagram or if your game still isn't open you can text me on instagram there's this file you need to add maybe i'll make a separate video for that let me make a separate video for that but if you're having dump error or your fifa interface fails to launch this is what you're supposed to do and all you have to do is just right click um double click this and your fifa should come on in no time so please don't forget to like the video comment here if it works for you please leave a comment if it doesn't leave a comment also i'll i'll let you know what to do and you should you guys should also watch my other videos before you say your fifa isn't launching and if it persists if the problem persists still you can text me on instagram i'll ask you i'll personally ask you to text me on instagram then we can find a way to start out your issues for you as for people who have controller issues um text me on instagram i can help you to fix that till i make a video about it as you can see the, the anti cheat boots up and the game should come up in no time remember please don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you are new please i drop i give people fixes for their games mostly fifa though i haven't looked into other games for now so please don't forget to like so
just give me that encouragement to do more videos please and push my channel to 2k subs for me so as you can see the game boots up already so click this and this should be opening for people having black screens here too this fix also works for you it also works for you as you can see my game is working properly and here we go try to log in Okay, I'll close the game as soon as I can. Yes. So that's it. That's it. That's the fix for today. Please don't forget to like my channel. Don't forget to like the video, comment, and please subscribe to my channel if you are new. And thank you for watching. God bless you all. I hope this fix your FIFA for you. If it doesn't, don't forget to text me on Instagram. The link should be on in description. And I, I'll also put the other video links in the description of this video. Alright, bye guys. Next time. See y'all.